Alrighty guys, welcome back to the next episode of the Climb Up the Divisions to see how far we can get in Ultimate Team. Now, in the last episode we did win the Division 7 title. We got 3 from 3 uh, wins which was awesome and we got a lot of coins and we did actually end up changing a bit of uh, changing a bit of the team up. So the Serie A team is staying the same just for a little while. I might look at changing it up eventually, but we've changed the uh, the English team. We've kept the, uh, the sort of U shape going around, so the right mid, right back, uh, two centre backs, left back, left mid, and goalkeeper. They've stayed all the same, and uh, we've just decided to improve the uh, centre mid, two cams, and striker. Now, the team name has changed from uh, three lines to the channel, so you can maybe guess what's going on. I'm not 100% sure, um, but the centre mid is going to be actually a CDM, and it's Matweedy. So I'm excited to see how Matweedy goes there. The cam is going to be Payette, which is pretty exciting as well. Um, the center, center to other cam is actually a center mid, it's going to be Kabai, and the striker is going to be Lacazette, the upgraded Lacazette 82. So, um, sort of the English Channel type of thing, I think, I'm pretty sure it's from England or France from memory. Um, so that's sort of the whole plan of this, uh, this team. So it looks a little bit more solid in the center of the park with Matuidi there holding, uh, holding things up, and then, uh, Payette and Kabai there with some, uh, creative geniuses between them. And then uh, Lacazette up top, the absolute pace demon and shooting monster. So it should be a lot of fun. And this is obviously the first team we're going to be using. We used the Serie A squad at the last game, so we'll get into the next game. Alrighty, so we come up as Sanchez team, 84 rated, 100 chemistry. And it is literally a Sanchez team. It's got Alexis Sanchez up top. So it's a bit of a hybrid, a Serie A slash... Um, Serie A slash... French League slash Premier League hybrid. It's actually not too bad of a squad, so it's going to be tough to come up against with some uh, some great pacey players in there as well. So hopefully we can do the job here and um, and get the win here in the first game of Division Six. Playing through like is that? Come on, finish it, get in. Ah, oh, straight at Sirigu. Oh my God, pay it. Oh my God, straight at Sirigu again. I'll oh, play him through. You might be offside, Lacazette. If he's not, it's a goal. Oh, someone's offside. I think it was Lacazette. Someone out of the two of them is offside. I'm not 100% sure. Either way, it was a beautiful through ball. It is Lacazette that was offside. Payette was on. It was a good through ball across to him. But unfortunately, Lacazette was offside before he played that through ball. Oh, there we go. Play him through. Come on, Lacazette. Finish it. Get in. There we go. That is the first goal. A mistake by him at the back. Payette pounces on it and uh, just plays that ball through to Lacazette, who finishes it first time around the keeper. 1 0. Sanchez, gotta stop him, gotta stop him. Oh my god, no, 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 no. Oh, he's put it over. Hazard has put it over. That is insane. That is so lucky. Got problems, got problems. Ah, oh, Davies, you absolute monster. Ah, oh, still got problems though. No, 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 no. That is bullshit! That is bullshit that he gets that rebound. Oh, that's so frustrating. Ah, oh, I mean, he played well all game, I suppose. He probably maybe deserves a draw, but still, I think we played a little bit better than him. That is a frustrating game to draw at the end there. So stupid. Ah, oh, Lacazette's a terror up front, though. Hopefully he can get some more goals. It's just that guy defended really well. It was hard to score against. And uh, Ramirez there looks like he wants to eat someone. But the next game is going to be back with the Serie A squad. So hopefully we can get our get our first win in Division 6. Alrighty, Foot FC is the new opponent for the Serie A squad. 87 rated, 100 chem. It's a full legend side. Are you fucking kidding me? Who has a full legend side? Lehman, Neville, uh, Blanc, Cannavaro, Carlos. I think that's Effenberg maybe? I can't even fucking think it. Oh my god, this team is just fucking ridiculous. That is insane. Oh my god, we're so lucky. We're so lucky to get that ball back. That was insane. I actually didn't mean to hit it. I meant to do a tackle. He's hit it. Just here. I meant to, like, tackle. He's hit it. It's found, bounced off, I think, Roberto Carlos. And Cooker has got the rebound and put it in. 1-0. Playing through. There we go. Rossi, you are through from Roberto Carlos. Get in there, Rossi. Giuseppe Rossi. No. Play it up. Hit it, Dutz it, Bonaventura. Oh my god, it's gone in! It's gone in! <laughs> Lehman couldn't save it. He was probably blindsided a little bit, but it's gone out to Bonaventura. What a ball. And then, oh my goodness, we'll take it. 2 0. 
Play him through. Play him through. Higuain, finish it. Get in. There we go. That is 3-0. Made the mistake of passing it on the on the pass out. And I think it fell to Rossi. And Rossi blitzed it into Higuain. One step outside and finessed it past the goalkeeper to make it 3-0. Oh, but then again, that can happen too. Sometimes their skill can show through. <laughs> Roberto Carlos this one from 30 yards in the top corner. Oh, what a ball, Pjanic. Oh my god, pass it across. What a goal. Pjanic with a through ball that split open about 10 people. Pounding of the Red Sea, his defense was. That was insane. Oh my god, that deserved a finish. And it got the nice little tab across goal. Kuka with the finish. Pjanic, you are a god. There we go, Pepe. Play it in. Oh, a little bit harder. Oh, my God. He's hit it. Radu. Radu, the left back. Oh, my goodness. He's run up the whole field. Kept going. I meant to play it inside there. Well, I, yeah, I played it inside. Got deflected. Radu with the effort, though. That was a beautiful finish. 5-1 against this Legends team. Not bad at all. Oh, Maggio. Oh, we're away there. The end of the game, though. 5-1 against a full Legends squad. Now that shows just how good this Serie A team can be and just how bad people can be even if they have good squads. So don't get discouraged if they, the team is absolutely amazing. You can still beat it. So that's a big, big victory right there. So let's go back to the other squad, the hybrid French-Italian, uh, French-English squad. And we'll see if we can get a first win on the board for that one and another win in Division 6. Alrighty, so before we get into game number three with the channel side, we actually bought a new player. So, Jay Rodriguez wasn't doing the greatest out on the left. He just probably wasn't really that quick. Um, decent enough shooting, but just wasn't outstanding. So, we bought in uh, Alessandrini. So, he's got four-star skills, 91 pace, and that 79 dribbling, 77 shooting. He looks like an absolute monster. So, hopefully, he can do a bit, do a, a bit of a job on that left-hand side and uh, try and improve this team. Alrighty, Whitboys, 82 rated, 100 chem. It looks like a BPL team thanks to the manager, and it is. So it's Costa and, and uh, Sturridge up front. So it's just the generic BPL. I am happy to see Seamus Coleman in there. I've mentioned it before. I love Coleman as a player. He's pretty good in this game as well. So it's good to see someone different from Walker or Klein in there in a BPL squad. But uh, see if we can get a win. Uh, see if Alessandrini can do a, a bit of a job on this left-hand side. Let's uh, try and release him now. There we go. Alessandrini, what can you do? Cut down? Oh, I got blocked. Oh, Sturridge is through here. Scary stuff. He hits it. Oh my god, he puts it in the back of the net. This guy's a very, very good player. Probably the best player we've played in this series so far. Just from You can just tell straight away. He knows how to dribble, knows how to skill, and he knows how to put a through ball through and finish when he needs to. Sturridge, 1-0. Oh my god, look at that. Look at that. Sturridge, so strong. You can't even hold him off. Like, that's Stephen Corker running at him and pulling him down. Pretty sure. Like, you can't even stop him. That's insane. There we go. Have a hit, goodbye. Get in. Put it in. Goodbye. Oh, my God. I don't know what happened there, but it's gone in the back of the net somehow. Did it take a deflection? It probably did, because it didn't look like that good of a shot. And it took a bit of a deflection. So, a lucky goal there, but we will take it. Need all the help we can get against this guy. Oh, Lacazette, you're through, son. Finish it. Get in. Oh, Lacazette. Oh, my God. Lacazette. Pay it. Someone. There we go. Two all. Bit of a scrappy goal, but we'll take it. This guy looks like he's going for bloody uh, YouTube goals. He's going for a lot of skill runs and stuff like that. Um, if he scores one, he probably deserves it. He's a very good player. But he's using the ball roll really well, which is so OP in, uh, in Ultimate Team. I don't know what that was, but still. No. Really. That's the goal. Really. <sighs> it's a little bit lucky like my other one, to be fair. Still, I hate skillers that just get the bounce, the ball straight back. Don't be a penalty, and it is. Oh, it's so frustrating. Like, they do these fucking skill moves, right? It's all sweet. And I, I tackle them perfectly, but they get the bounce. As soon as people do a skill move, it's just retarded how much they just get the ball back just because they're doing a skill move. Like, if they fuck up a skill move, they deserve to lose the ball. It's their fault, realistically. Oh, uh, what a save, though. No. Oh my god, Keeper, why did you come off the line? Such crap. I didn't call him off the line. Stay on the fucking line. Go for it, Lacazette. There we go, the finesse shot. Oh my goodness, that deserved to go in. That's so wrong. So very wrong. Oh, Payette, come on, get in there. 
Get in there, finish it, pay it. Oh, it's a great tackle. Oh my god, pay it. Oh my god. So unlucky, does not get a goal there at the end. Oh, so crazy. Probably should have just gone out and skilled a little bit more. Maybe I should just do that in general. If it's going to work against players like that, like that, that are really good, maybe it'll work against some uh, defenders and try and get us around it sometimes. But uh, what can you do? We lost 4 2 there. The guy was a really good player. Um, yeah, can't really do anything more than that. He's just so good, like realistically. Um, don't know how I'm finding him in Division 6, but what can you do? But uh, that's going to pretty much end this episode. And uh, we've got, what is it now, a win, a draw, and a loss, I think, now in um, Division 6. So not great, but we should hopefully still get out of the division. We need, what do we need? Uh, 12 points in 7 games. So we need 4 wins. Um, or we need 15 points in 7 games for the title. So we really want to get the title. So 5 wins, if possible. Um, it's going to be tough, though. So I hope you guys enjoyed this one. I've been VO, and peace.